Barrel Craft Spirits is all about transparency. Check out their back label and you will see every state of distillation that goes into the batch. Find out more at BarrelBourbon.com. Welcome to another Whiskey Quickie, and today we're looking at Woodford Reserve Baccarat. So, Baccarat. Yes, it's French, if you didn't know that, but... What does Baccarat mean? Baccarat, well, you might... And this is, you know, being from Kentucky, you know, getting this in the mail, and I was like, Baccarat? What, Kentucky, what's Baccarat? You're talking about Versailles, Kentucky. <laughs> yeah, Versailles, <laughs> Kentucky, exactly. Instead of Versailles. <laughs> but, so, Baccarat is one of the leading crystal manufacturers in the world, based out of Baccarat, France, as you might think of. But before getting into talking about the crystal and everything else, let's give it a little bit of a history about what's going on with this particular whiskey. So this is only available for the longest time in travel retail luxury markets. And that's because, and I want to go ahead and tell the price on this, this is an SRP of $2,000 for this particular bottle. Now we had an opportunity to actually talk to Chris Morris uh, during a Zoom call and kind of like ask questions about this. And you know, they had mentioned that, you know, first off, the whiskey in itself is standard Woodford Reserve. It's 90.4 proof. However, what it does is it actually is aged in exo cognac cask for an additional three years. Ooh. Yes. So always fun to be able to see that. Should I say it's barrel proof from the cognac cask and then it's bottled at 90.4 proof, which is the standard for Woodford Reserve. Um, other things about this is that this is now moving into the U.S. market there are only going to be 2,000 bottles available in the U.S. market for this particular year. They're going to try, try to release 2,000 bottles every single year. The problem why they can't release even more of that is because a single crystal decanter takes five days to make. So wow. you can imagine that the time it goes into it. Um, also, to kind of set the, uh, the stage correctly is that we know $2,000 is a lot to ask for a particular bottle. But if you look at other Baccarat uh, additions that are coming from other scotches and stuff like that. This is actually on the very low end of what some of them are. Some of them are like $15,000 per bottle. So just to give you an idea, there's a lot of money that is sunk into the crystal here. Yeah, I have a lot of those, you know, $15,000 ones. I'm <laughs> glad they brought the price down for us peasants. Yes, yes. So I, I guess when you get done with it, don't throw it away and use it as an actual decanter. I know what you're getting for my birthday. Yes. Yeah. We got, we got that covered for you, buddy. Perfect. All right. So let's go ahead and let's dive in with this. So on the nose. Hmm. Definitely get a little bit of that cognac taste to it. Yeah. It's got that, you know, that plum kind of mm -hmm. thing. Grapey. For sure. Kind of wine notes in there. Yeah. And the, the interesting thing is three years additional added for a second barreling. You don't see that too often. Usually it's like six months. So hopefully you're gonna get a lot more of those characteristics out of a cognac cask in there too. And cognac casks are huge. Like they're not 53 gallons. They're, they're much bigger. They're diesel daddies. Yes, they are. Diesel daddies. I like that. All right, on the taste. Mm. It's that cognac it's like, finish. It's like creamy raisin bread, bread pudding kind of thing going. Mm -hmm. Like... It's kind of a little cinnamon syrup drizzled all over. I like the cinnamon syrup. I can yeah. kind of, I can totally get that right now. Yeah, it reminds me of like my favorite bread pudding, like with raisins. There Lots you of raisins. I like it. Yeah. All right, so let's go ahead and rate this. So on the nose, where are you at? Thumbs up. I really liked it. Mm -hmm. And the taste? Thumbs up. Loved it. And the finish? Thumbs up. Really loved it. There you go. Yeah. I, when you said Baccarat, I thought it was a game at first, but I'm, <laughs> this was really good. Yes. <laughs> Uh, definitely awesome. And thank you, Woodford Reserve and Brown Form for letting us have the opportunity to try and review it too. Cheers, everybody. We'll see you next time.